I think this was a like a very aggressive contest from Darmon because you have to appreciate that Beryl isn't here yet, which means that the immediate collapse onto Canyon was excellently done from Sword Art. And while he does get chunked out initially, this is where Darmon feel that they have the numbers advantage. But here, SOFN then dives onto the bot lane. He's trying to zone them away from the fight and he's trying to soak up all this damage. Showmaker then commits to trade his life, but then he's then able to get out thanks to the Lantern. Then I love this commitment from Bin as well because it splits up Darmon once again. And then again, you'll see here from SOFM. Oh. Gonna land that root by stacking it up on the Gromp. Who else is on the way? Beryl is on the warpath. Ghost is gonna be respawning Three. soon. He's got one more shot. SOFM, a full bar underneath. This is for the soul. Huan Feng reloads. One, two, throws out the grenade. Five shot, number two. The dragon's going low. It's picked up by shooting. They get themselves the soul. But they win the fight. Cut. That's a flash forward. One Feng gets Canyon. Now Nogri's left inside the pit. Beryl's got no damage. SOFM steps back into the bush. Jumps onto Nogri, jumps onto Beryl. Does it again. A multi man stun once again from Angel. Beryl will be able to find the death centers. That almost shots down Angel but there won't be enough from the Moonlight Vigil. And here comes SOFM looking for Beryl. Soon he get the soul. There is a reason that he has style in his name as he is styling all over damn one with this Rengar. This game, there has been a lot of it, but when you get down into the chaos, it is it is Suning's homegrown turf. The way in which they're able to play these small skirmishes, playing under this level of pressure, is where we get to see some of the best from this Suning squad. And just look at how much damage SOFM is tanking up, using the brushes to keep diving into the back line. His positioning is always great. And, you know, I had question marks around this tank Rengar build, but this is its purpose, to just be obnoxious, to buy time,